Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am sharing with you my favorite cruelty-free hair products. And I have never really found that many hair products that I just fell in love with or that were very well suited to my hair type. And finally, I can say that I have found a good solid set of products that I absolutely love. They make my hair feel very healthy and nourished. And the best part is that they are all cruelty-free. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> with my two favorite shampoos and the very first one is from Paul Mitchell. This is the Tea Tree Special Shampoo. So the smell of this is very invigorating. It's definitely a tea tree peppermint type of a smell which I personally love that because it just makes me feel very clean. The smell of peppermint is just very soothing to me, calming, also uplifting. So I love the scent of this because it is more um, natural and spa-like and the second reason that I love this is because it really cleans your hair and it gets all of the um, buildup out of your roots or like if you have a lot of hair products that are built up, hairspray, mousses, um, creams, any basically any styling products that you have build up in your hair, this will get rid of that entirely. And for me, that was a big issue because I have drier ends, but yet I get a lot of buildup and I have oily roots. So I kind of needed a shampoo to tackle that. And this one is the perfect one. And an important thing about this shampoo it does not strip your hair because you definitely don't want to strip your hair but you want to remove all of that buildup. This definitely gets the job done. And also I wanted to mention that this does not make your hair very tangly because a lot of the times if you have a shampoo that's really good at cleansing your hair, it kind of makes your hair tangled, feel dry, stripped, and this does none of those things. It makes it feel very healthy, clean, voluminous, and I can definitely tell the difference when I'm blow drying my hair and I just have a lot more volume. And I can feel that my hair like right now I just used this last night and my hair feels so clean and nourished and moving on to the second shampoo so this particular shampoo is for people that have blonde or silver hair so this is from the brand AG hair care this is their sterling silver shampoo so I have used tons and tons of different blonde shampoos over the past couple of years and this is the very best one so the scent of this to me kind of smells like bubble gum it's a very nice fresh type of scent um, maybe kind of almost like a coconut even or a vanilla but I love this shampoo so a lot of the times blonde shampoos are bad about stripping your hair they make it very tangly hard to comb through this one does not do any of those things it feels very nourished it feels super super soft and I have no issues combing through my hair so if you are on the lookout for a blonde shampoo highly highly recommend this and it is pricey however I definitely think it's worth it and you do get a better value if you get the 33.8 ounces I did get this at Ulta and also I did get the tea tree shampoo at Ulta as well okay next up I have a um, deep conditioning mask so this is from the brand Brio Geo and this is their don't despair repair honey moisture deep conditioning mask so it comes in this super cute packaging it's a little um, honey bear and I use this um, not every single day so basically with my hair I wash wash it every other day because I do have oily roots and I cannot just let that sit on my hair for days on end so I do have to do wash my hair every other day but every other day I will use this deep conditioning mask and what I do is just do it from the um, like the middle of my hair down I never put it up here just because it would be way too greasy for my hair however if you have super dry hair you could definitely get away with using it all over but this makes my hair soft it looks so shiny and healthy and nourished when I'm finished with it like even if I blow dry my hair it looks so beautiful healthy conditioned but yet it's not a super heavy mask which I love because a lot of the times masks really weigh your hair down and this does not it makes your hair feel light 
fluffy and soft. Okay, now I have four different styling products. So the first one that I wanted to mention, or this isn't really a styling product, but this is from Sunbum. This is a hair lightener. So my first job was a lifeguard back in 2011. I did that for three summers. Absolutely love that job. I have such great memories from it. And this is part of those memories because I would spray this on my hair before I would go out and um, watch the kids in the pool. And my hair got so, so light and it just kind of does um, being blonde out in the sun it gets those sun-kissed highlights which I absolutely loved so I have continued to use this and there are hairdressers that will tell you not to use this because it will dry out your hair which yes that is true because this does have hydrogen peroxide in it so be aware if you have super dry hair I might not recommend this product and it's not intended for extended use so how I use this is maybe like every um, two weeks I'll spray this on my hair and blow dry it or you can spray it go out in the sun um, whatever is best suited to your lifestyle but this definitely lightens your hair and then combined with the purple shampoo it tones the um, orangey or like brassy tones out of your hair because you don't want those you want it to be nice and bright and more silky silvery rather than orange but this is intended for light brown to blonde hair so if you have dark brown or anything darker than that do not use this product because it will turn your hair orange so be mindful of that and use it sparingly don't use it often but definitely recommend it if you're wanting to get a very natural sun-kissed highlights in your hair next up I have two different primers they're at two different price points so the first one is from Bumble and Bumble this is the hairdressers invisible oil heat and UV protective primer and it does say for dry to very dry hair but again I have oily roots drier ends so I focus this from the middle of my hair down I try to avoid this area of my head to avoid um, the look of like I've had a bucket of water dumped on my head because that is not an attractive look but this is a wonderful product for people that have very hard to comb hair that gets very tangly like I do this is a life saver and again it makes your hair look very very healthy and shiny and nourished um, I did use this last night and as you can see my hair um, to me looks very healthy and it's not frizzy I don't see any hair sticking up around my face which I have a lot of baby hairs around my face and they tend to kind of fly away frizz up and I think it is so annoying and this definitely combats that and tames them down so this is pricey this is 8.5 ounces and I cannot remember if this was I want to say it was $28 $29 however I do think it's worth the price and the scent of this is very subtle and soft so definitely not in your face and I love that okay now if you want a similar effect from a product but you don't want to pay that much I found this at Costco um, a week or so ago and this is from the brand Eva NYC it is their main magic 10 in 1 primer so this contains argon oil sunflower seed oil and it has 10 benefits in one miracle formula so I am crazy about this product and honestly I don't know if I'll purchase this one again or this one or just keep using both because I love them pretty much equally but this is nine dollars and 49 cents or I say that it was either 9.49 or 9.99 at Costco and it also came with the mini um, travel version with it and the scent of this is definitely stronger than the bumble and bumble it's more of a um, I'd say like a warmer scent yeah, kind of like a, almost like an exotic scent. I It's a warm, kind of like an amber musk is how I would describe this. Smells beautiful on the hair. I would actually love a perfume in this, quite honestly. It smells that good. But again, this makes your hair very easy to comb through and it just looks so soft and healthy. And I love that look, especially in spring and summer, all year round, you want healthy hair. But I feel like especially spring and summer when we're in the pool or in the ocean, beach, wherever it might be, and you have a lot of sun on your hair, it gets very damaged and frizzy and you get those horrible looking ends on um, your hair and you want to tame those down, tame down the frizz, the flyaways and nourish your hair. This is a great product to do that so whether you try the bumble and bumble or the Eva NYC recommend them both this is $28 for 8.5 ounces and this is $9 I want to say $9.99 for 6 ounces so um, 
there's a little bit more in this one but the price is just like amazing the price difference between the two but recommend them both all right and the very last styling product i wanted to mention is from paul mitchell this is the invisible wear undone texture hairspray so the reason i love this is because whenever i style my hair um, with curls or i want more of a beachy look i love having a texture spray on my hair but the problem is a lot of them make it, your hair feel very crunchy and stiff and i don't like that look because you want it to be a very natural texture, undone, beachy, mermaid type of look. And this achieves that perfectly. You can't see it in your hair. You can't really feel it in your hair, but yet you can see the texture and the waves are more defined. And I love that look. It is so beautiful, especially in the summer. It just goes really well with like cute maxi dresses or bright summery tops, um, cut off shorts. It just gives you that easy, breezy, beautiful look. And I love that. So that does conclude my favorite cruelty free hair products of the moment if you did enjoy this video and you found it helpful don't forget to leave a thumbs up and let me know some of your favorite cruelty free hair products i'm always looking for something new and exciting to try and coming up on friday i'm going to be showing you a super super easy way to achieve mermaid waves and i'm actually going to be using these products in that video probably either this one or this one but it's a beautiful simple look and i think you guys will really love it so look for that on friday and i will see you then bye